Welcome to the Theosophical Society in America and to this, our June video blog. I'm very happy to share with you the many things that have happened here at our national headquarters over the past month. The weather has gotten warm. It feels like summer. The grass is growing. The flowers are blooming. And the Prairie School of DuPage, which is located here in our building, is ending its school year. So the voices of the children are even more joyous than normal. In May, many of the staff members celebrated the life of Pete Pedersen, his lovely wife Lois and their family held a celebration of Pete's life in their hometown of Joliet, Illinois. We joined them at this joyous occasion, this celebration of the incredible life of an amazing man. Into his 99th year, Pete was driving from Joliet to Wheaton, a 45 minute drive every week to do his volunteer work with the Theosophical Book Gift Institute. Pete was a staff member for many, many, many years. He is well loved and tremendously missed. In May, we also celebrated White Lotus Day. White Lotus Day is traditionally celebrated by members of the Theosophical Society around the world. It is the anniversary of the death of Helena Blavatsky, one of the co-founders of the Theosophical Society. She died in 1891. We celebrated White Lotus Day in the Alcott Library here on our campus. Selections were read from three different books, the Bhagavad Gita, the Light of Asia, and Voice of the Silence. We talked a bit about the legacy that she left for all of us, and we meditated in gratitude and appreciation for this tremendous wisdom which she shared. It is called White Lotus Day because the lotus flower is rooted in the muck, the dirt, the silt of a pond or a river, and it makes its way up through the murky water and it blooms and blossoms in the light, very much like we do. We're rooted here in this physical world, and we're all working so hard to bloom in the light of our higher selves. Everyone here at Alcott is also working very hard in preparation for our summer national convention. It will be held in July. It begins on Friday night, July 20th, and goes until noon on Tuesday, July 24th. The topic for this year's summer convention is Radiant Light, Divine Darkness, Illuminating the Mysteries of the Soul. We have a number of wonderful speakers coming. We have a half day volunteer or service activity planned. We have fun entertainment, but most importantly, we get together. We have the comradeship, the collegiality, the joy of being with others of like mind. I hope that you can attend. Look on our website for information about registering for convention or contact us. We'd love to have you here. The staff is also very busy preparing for our annual open house, Theosophist. This occurs on the second Saturday of September. This year, Theosophist will be held on September the 8th. Last year, we had over 3,000 people come through the gates of Alcott and join us for this amazing festival. Vegetarian and vegan food, vendors of all sorts, we also have, and most importantly have, lectures in our auditorium all day and meditations in the meditation room all day. It's a day of 
learning, a day of excitement, a day of coming together. We're always looking for volunteers. So if you're interested in volunteering, we'd be happy to talk to you about that possibility. If you'd like to just attend the Awesome Fest, we'd love to have you with that as well. I hope that you can attend. And again, I hope that you can attend our Summer National Convention. In the meantime, I hope you have a wonderful summer, a wonderful June, and I look forward to talking with you again next month. Take care of yourselves and talk with you soon.